what's going on everybody welcome back to another video and in this video we will be going over the brand new worldwide down celebration part two units um i was actually very excited for this um sorry for being late on all these uploads and stuff like that we are currently in school and stuff so it's kind of hard to get these videos out on time once they come out since um i'm not getting out until around four and stuff like that but no need to worry about that we'll still be able to get the videos out in general so in this video we're going to be covering the brand new lr intelligence broly from movie 10 obviously um he is a standalone he has um an active or domain and he also has a revival skill so we're gonna uh, show all those off um right now i'm not gonna play any audio since i have music already playing in the background um so i'm just gonna just show a quick glance of all the animations and then dive into the big boys and and see what this dude broly is all about right here so this is a 12 key these animations actually do look pretty good um if you don't mind i'm gonna turn this music up all right so i turned that up just a little bit just so it wasn't too low i don't know if it's too loud uh, this is 18 key. We're not really worried about the animations here. Um, you can find them anywhere. Just look them up. It's not what we're really covering in the video today. So we're going to go ahead and pass that. And let's just talk about the unit. So um, as you see, Extreme Int, LR Broly. Categories is Uncontrollable Power, Planetary Destruction, Transformation Boost, Resurrected Warriors, Target Goku, Inhuman Deeds, Power Beyond, Super Saiyan, Powerful Comeback, Legendary Existence, Explosion, Rage, Full Power, Pure Saiyan, the Movie Bosses, Revenge. So pretty much just all the categories you would expect a Broly to have. And um, they threw on the new category, obviously. And then Revenge, since this is the Movie 10 Broly. So he also leads Revenge. He leads the new category, Revenge and Planet Day Destruction for 170. And then the extra 30 is from Pure Saints Movie Bosses and Transformation Boosts. I actually haven't took a look at this category yet. But I'm assuming it's just Broly's and like Boos and the stuff you can expect. So I'm assuming it'll be a pretty good category overall. Um, His 12 key massively raises the attack and defense for one turn. And a high chance of further raising defense for one turn. And causes colossal damage with a high chance of stunning. This is actually very huge massively raises if you don't know is 100 so every 12 key is just gonna be 100 attack 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 over and over um which is very good also that for the defense so 100 defense 100 defense um and especially if you can do a lot of additionals this will be huge um so i obviously have a good decent idea of what he can do but this is going to be my first in-depth look um that wasn't just like skimming over it as they were going through the stream and stuff and then his Ultra Super also massively raises with a high chance of further massively raising attack, which is extra 100% attack. So this guy, just like all the other Broly's, like the Easy Attack Broly, the New Tech Broly, they're just going to be destructive damage wise. Even the AGL LR Broly still is damaging like crazy. So this Broly team is literally just that crazy damage that you would expect. And the double massively raise is really going to be a huge thing and then especially when you proc this which i have high percent is i'm uh, pretty sure 50 percent so you'll definitely notice when that procs because it's going to be an extra 100 attack moving on to is um passive skill pretty big pause activates the entrance animation upon the character entry once only extreme class allies defense plus 40 percent for four turns from the character's entry turn so overall that's pretty good I mean, um, he's giving extra defense and support to extreme class allies, which is actually very helpful because um, if we look at some of the units that are lacking defensively wise, such as Tech Broly or Int Broly, this will be a good thing to have um, just in general for four turns. And then attack and defense plus 260% and reduce the damage received by 60%. So that's just flat, which is crazy, which is huge. A lot of damage reduction, and then he gains an additional 100% attack when attacking. 
and then gains an additional key plus two and recovers two percent hp per type key sphere obtained so if you're wondering why he didn't have keyness um is straight up um just like first line is because he's just getting two key or tech key spheres which i should i mean not tech key spheres int key spheres which should just be four then now or per tech key sphere so he'll be getting that like crazy and then he's gonna activate his domain which changes random type of key sphere um that's not enter str to str at the start of the character is attacking turn and guards all attacks what this tells me since this guy's not str um probably the tur str broly or the lr str broly might uh get a s um a super easy a and they might need str orbs to do damage or get more defense or something like that so he's probably just helping that and then he guards all attacks <clears throat> Attacks effect against all types for the rest of battle when the character performs an attack while the domain molten lava of Natada village is active. I really like the name. It's very unique. Um, but this is when you proc this domain, it's huge. You're getting the orb change. You're starting to gar now. Attacks become all effective, especially how strong this guy is. That's going to be such a huge thing. And you're just going to see so much more damage coming out of this guy. Um, and then coming after that, starting from the fifth turn from the character's entry turn. Revives with 60% HP recovery when the character or an ally attacking the same turn is KO'd, which is huge. Like like I said, with Tech Broly and Int Broly, the weaker um, Broly's. Well, not weaker Broly's, weaker Broly's of defensively. I would say Int and Tech, the new Tech, are the defensive ones. Int, T-U-R, Saiyan Day one, and the Easy A Tech one are more of the, the two lackluster defensive Broly's that we've gotten so far. So it's huge if they can die and just we can get this um, revival proc. It gets you uh, a 60% defense when receiving an attack after the character or an ally's revival still is active, which is really huge just to have an extra more defense on top of this damage reduction guard you're going to have. And then it changes Fizz Key Fierce to Int Key Spheres and then gets uncontrollable, uncontro uncontrollable power category allies attacking defense plus 60%. Which is very good. Once again, more buffs to the, the weaker units on the team. Like in, in Broly. And then at the um that's at the start of uh, the character's attacking turn starting from the turn in which the character revival skill is active. So after the revival skill turn, that will proc. So overall he looks very good um offensively, of course, with the the massively raising on the twelve and eighteen key. And then he looks like a monster defensively. I mean, he has 60% damage reduction. He's guarding when you proc that um, the domain. And then there's just ton of support. You have this support, the 40%. You're getting uh, the 60% down here. This guy seems pretty good. And um, I can't wait just to see him in action. Um, his active skill massively raises the attack temporarily and causes ultimate damage to enemy and creates the domain molten lava um of the natada village for three turns so it's very short domain but this is good i think they did this so it doesn't uh conflict with the adl lr broly's domain so this ends immediately or this ends before um it'll be time to proc the agl one and then the active skill condition is when there's a goku family's category enemy or when all allies attack it in the same turn are uncontrollable characters i mean uncontrollable power category characters um here's the animation for the proc in the domain he just kind of just shoves you into the ground and then the lava comes up so nothing crazy it looks pretty good though his animations do look uh really nice <laughs> oh bless me so there's that proc and we can also see what he looks like when you're scrolling with him in game here down here very interesting um and then here's that revival skill what that looks like once again this gives you all those um the defensive 60 percent buff and then also procs the the key sphere changing and then the uncontrollable power category ally support so once you proc this this will be huge um moving past that his domain um, uncontrollable power category enemies and allies attack and defense plus 15% and then increases damage received by superclass enemies and allies by 15% plus an additional 10% damage received 
for characters who also belong on movie heroes category. So that's actually pretty unfortunate because um, not as in so that this is bad. So if you were trying to run a super class character, um, they would just be getting destroyed. But it's not very common. You're going to be doing that anyway. So not a very crazy restriction there. And then they just continue explaining the rest of his passive. And then they go on to Gohan, which we'll obviously talk about in the Gohan video. This is um, the Imp Broly. Let me know you guys' thoughts on him. Do you think he's good? Do you think he's bad? Anything that um, you're not a fan of in his kit or anything you would have changed? Let me know your, all your thoughts down below in the comments. We'll drop that Gohan video right after this. So be on the lookout for that. Without further ado, that's going to be the video, man. Drop a like. Subscribe to my channel if you're new, and we're going to see you in the next video. Peace.